Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to our channel. Today we're delving into the depths of gaming history and exploring how one game forever changed the landscape of storytelling in video games. And that game is Half-Life. Released in 1998, Half-Life took the world by storm. But it wasn't just the gameplay that revolutionized the industry. It was the opening sequence that set a new precedent for storytelling in games. Let's get into it. Before Half-Life, games had largely relied on static cutscenes, text-based dialogues, and cut-and-dry mission briefings to deliver narratives. There was a clear divide between gameplay and story. Half-Life altered this format drastically. Its opening sequence, also known as the Black Mesa Inbound, was a near 10-minute tram ride that effortlessly weaved together exposition, world-building, and character introduction in a way that was entirely passive from a gameplay standpoint, but entirely immersive from a narrative one. Starting with the protagonist, Gordon Freeman, boarding a tram, this mundane act was instantly transformed into a journey into the unknown. Players were guided through the bowels of the Black Mesa Research Facility, given tantalizing glimpses of the vast, secretive world they were about to be thrust into. This tram ride was a masterclass in environmental storytelling. The facility's daily routine, the science experiments gone awry, the foreboding presence of the military, it was a microcosm of the game's narrative delivered in a single, uninterrupted shot. Half-Life's opening sequence forever changed the perception of what video game storytelling could be. It inspired countless games like Bioshock and The Last of Us to use similar techniques, setting the stage for narratives within the gameplay itself and blurring the lines between playing and experiencing. Many games today owe their immersive narrative styles to Half-Life's influence. We see long, uninterrupted shots, in-game storytelling, and a drive towards a more cinematic gaming experience. Half-Life's opening sequence is a testament to the power of clever design and innovative storytelling. It serves as a reminder that the medium of video games is uniquely positioned to deliver narratives in a way that no other form of entertainment can. So, the next time you play a game and find yourself engrossed in the world without a single cutscene, remember the tram ride that started it all. Remember Half-Life. Who would make a valuable addition to the Black Mesa team? Immediate openings are available in the areas of materials handling and low clearance security. Please contact Black Mesa personnel for further information. If you have an associate with the Black Mesa, the areas of vehicle physics, biotechnology, or other high tech designs, Please contact our civilian recruitment division. The Black Mesa Research Facility is an equal opportunity employer. A reminder to all Black Mesa personnel. Regular radiation and biohazard screenings are a requirement of continued employment in the Black Mesa Research Facility. Missing a scheduled urinalysis or radiation checkup is grounds for immediate termination. If you feel you have been exposed to radioactive or other hazardous materials in the course of your duties, contact your radiation safety officer immediately. Work safe. Work smart. Your future depends on it. Now arriving at Sector C Test Labs and Control Facilities. Please stand back from the automated door and wait for the security officer to verify your identity.
Before exiting the train, be sure to check your area for personal belongings. Thank you, and have a very safe and productive day. Morning, Mr. Freeman. Looks like you're running late.